Well, howdy, everyone, and Merry Christmas Eve 2020. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of cooking today. I'm going to try something a little different. I'm going to make some beer canned shrimp, and I'm going to be using, let's see, Bud Light Lime. That's right. So stay tuned. Let's put it together and see what happens. Okay, so I've got some medium sized shrimp. <laughs> Get back. <laughs> <laughs> Get back over the monkey. <laughs> they smell that shrimp. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Hang on. All right, I had to remove the shrimp from the equation. <laughs> but this Bud Light Lime, I've let it get down to room temperature. I'm going to transfer all of this <laughs> into, the <laughs> into there, into this bowl. <laughs> but watch <laughs> And as you saw, the medium-sized shrimp, uh, they're peel on and deveined. I've rinsed them a couple times. And uh, my next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the top off of this uh, can here, put the shrimp in there, pour the lime beer back in, into the can with the shrimp, and I'm going to set them on the grill and use the trash can top. And we're going we're gonna to see what happens. Stay tuned. <laughs> all right. Okay, also, depending on what you cut it with, that is sharp and jagged. And I'm going to use my glove here to fix all that, bend it in, so it won't be so dangerous. Uh, all right, hang tight. I'm going to fill this with shrimp, put the beer back in there, get the fire going, or sit it on there. Put our trash can top on there. Not that one, but our trash can pail. And get it going. Alright, hang on. Alright, yeah, so as you can see, I just bent in those edges uh, wearing a pair of gloves. Uh, didn't do a real good job on cutting that off. I started out with a knife and then ended up trying to use a little pair of scissors, but anyway. Yeah, just make sure you bend those in so you don't uh, you know, cut yourself or anything like that, but anyway, all right, moving right along. All right, charcoals are getting there fast, and what we're going to do, because beer can won't sit on this regular little grill grate, we're going to take one of these, set that on top of there, flat surface, and that'll work just fine. And uh, we're going to use our six gallon trash pail because the beer can is so tall that that lid won't work. All right, hang tight. All right, charcoals are ready. So what we're going to do is put that on top. I'm not even going to spread them out or smash them out. I want that cone, that pyramid to stay a pyramid so it'll direct that heat right to that beer can full of shrimp. Alright, hang on tight here. We'll get back. Okay, so here we are. Got our can. There's some shrimp in there. I've already put them in there. These still have the shells on them, but they are deveined. There's our lime beer. Now it's important also, well it's 30 degrees out here right now, <laughs> but uh, that beer is room temperature. So we're just going to load this can up. Get back. Kitty cats, right? Hello poo poo. All right. Okie dokie. Here comes another train, I can hear it. 
I live about 20 minutes north of Nashville, close to the Kentucky line, so weather is strange. Uh, all right, so anyway, we're going to pour this beer back in here. Hang on. Here, sniff on that. Oh, no, they want some. But uh, this, we're going to pour this lime beer back in the can with the shrimp. Well, like I said, those are peel on but deveined. And we're just gonna, well, that's pretty full. Fill it back up with that lime beer, pour off a little bit. Hey, come on. And we're gonna sit it right on there, just like that, right there. Now, here's the thing can't use that lid, right? We're gonna use our six gallon that's right fits right on there just like that I know it and we're gonna give that a little bit and hang tight check back it ain't over yet yeah that uh, evening uh, possible little snow flurry situation is looking like it's headed uh, this way. Of course, there's another train over there. A lot of trains today. But, uh, yeah, we got this going on. Uh, we'll check that here in just a second. All right. Okay, let's see if I can do this one-handed without knocking that beer can over. Uh, we're gonna take us a peek. Yeah, I can already feel it through the glove. It's pretty warm. All right. Oh yeah, they're looking orange. Right. Woo. Got a little bowl going on. Let's set that back on there. Mm. All right. We're getting there. Hang tight. Oh yeah. Merry Christmas. Okay, from that first time that we checked it, it had uh, been on there for about 20 minutes. This is only about five minutes later, so let's take a look. And those are done. Yeah, so all in all, 30 minutes, once you sit it on the fire, make sure that the fire is hot. You don't really have to spread out your coals if you're just doing one can like that. If you're doing something bigger, adjust your fire. Of course, that's a small grill, a small fire. All right, so all in all, what, 20, 30 minutes on the fire. And they are done. And let's get this into a bowl and add some more seasonings. All right, hang tight. Okay, so here we are. All in all, about 30 minutes on the fire. Let's take this off gently. Ah. Right. Those, uh, actually, those were kind of large shrimp. I've said medium at the beginning, but. As you can see there, steaming and done. So what we're gonna do is wanna take this very gently and carefully. Doesn't matter about the brick old block. We're gonna strain these. Just pour right in there, let it pour right on the ground. That's what I'm fixed to do. Oh yeah, look at that. Woo, steaming. Like I said, it's 30 degrees out here. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna peel the, uh, some of those, put them in this bowl and season them up. Hang tight. All oh, the kittens are <laughs> kittens are smelling that. Hang on. All right. Okay. So there it is. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw some butter in there. Lots of butter. Hey, butter makes it better. Some. Uh, tahine uh, season. Great stuff, great. I mean, we're just gonna put it on. Yeah, hey, come on. Now, this was already 
in uh, the Bud Light lime flavored beer. Garlic hot sauce. Right. I like my stuff spicy. Okay. Put that over there. Alright. Oop. Hello. Onion powder. Quite a bit. I like onion. Just that over there. And some black pepper. Yeah. Not a whole lot. Just a little bit. Set that right there. Put the top on it. That's right. Get down there. I don't know. What's up? And just shake the heck out of it. Alright, see all that in there? Gather some things and load up a truck Get up the black top throw a Got some steamy shrimp with a bunch of good seasoning. Oh yeah. Look at that. Let's try one. On some moonshine gonna get us a little bit of love. Get a buzz. Oh my god. Something like that. That is so good. You ready? Have it oh yeah. Fun. fun good. Recipe. Grill. Build a big fire by the creek side. Trash can. Beer can. Butter. Stuff laying on the ground. Holy moly. Merry Christmas. Everybody stay safe. Peace and joy. Alright everyone, hope you enjoyed that, it was fun, and it was good too, uh, Merry Christmas, peace, joy, safety to everyone and all y'all, have a good one, have fun, stay with the adventures, keep on, if you like my channel, uh, please subscribe, hit that like button, uh, hit that bell, so that way uh, you'll be notified uh, anytime I make something new and it comes out, until the next adventure, have a good one. So. Hey everyone, James here. I'm going to leave a link in the description below for another beer can shrimp video using Mike's Heart Lemonade. So be sure to check that one out. Until next cooking adventure, peace out. Stay safe. Hey everyone, also I'm going to leave a link, another link in the description about how to burn your trash can for trash can cooking. How to do it the most efficient, the best way. All right, hang tight.